how you guys doing? It's Poke Punch. Pretty excited today. Found this Toxtricity uh, Galler Power Mini Tin. And it goes back to 2020. So I'm, I'm excited to see what actually might be inside of it. Um, I did a little research and it may go as far back as, you know, base set sun and moon. Let's read a little bit of it. It says, each Pokemon TCG booster pack contains 10 cards and one basic energy, regular shit. This Galar mini tin, you'll find two booster packs, a metallic coin, and a card art of, I guess, whoever's in front of the tin. So just the tin itself. I think I paid $10 for this. You know, as you guys know, I do work at Walmart, so I get my little 10% whenever I can. Okay, I'll take that. I don't think I have that coin. We got the Charizard coin. We have the Toxtricity. Little promotional card. Five foot three. 88.2 pounds. When this Pokemon sounds as if it's strumming a guitar, it's actually clawing at the protrusions on its chest and generating electricity. So that gives you a little bit of insight right there. It's a poisonous electric type. And in the inside, we have... So, you know, I was hoping because it was 1995 to 2020 that they were going to, you know, have some sun and moon maybe in there. Um, some beginning, maybe chilling rain. I'll take the Astral Radiance. But then, you know, the Lost Origin, that's, that's a newer card. But don't let it bring you down we may get some good pulls off of this. Maybe because they're bringing it back, they're gonna put some fire in here to try to uh, spark our asses to, to go and buy some more Pokemon cards. So we'll bust that pack open. That's always a good sign. When you got the Sword and Shield, I'm telling you right now, you get this type of gold card, the green and white boy, and that's, that's for y'all. Whatever you get, whoever gets this, Sword and Shield Astro Radiance, you, let me know what you get. I know I had uh, another uh, subscriber who reached out to me. He told me he got some, some epic cards. Uh, he was excited about being able to have the opportunity to, to get some more gold cards. Because I don't think too many people, you know, even try to turn them in. We had the Cornados. And just so you all know, Astro Radiance is one of the sets from Sword and Shield that is keeping the same value and has some nice pulls in it. So give it a chance. You know, it may not have been the best then, but uh, now that every, all these other sets, everyone's buying, everyone's these terrestrial Charizards paying 400 and now they're $100. Get some Astro Radiance. Get a booster box and see what you can get. We got the Choi. Quillfish, Rolette, and even in Astro Radiance, I've always liked the, the cards. All right, so that's two. We got the Hesusian Quillfish and another Hesusian Quillfish. So that's a nice little, you know, brotherhood pull there. Maybe it's a good sign. Oshawa. We got the Hoo Hoo. Oh, I'll take it, baby. We got the Radiant Heatron. And what else we got? And the Susan Decidueye. So that's two nice pulls already off the rip. I'll take those guys. This card, these these packs are getting older and older. And remember, it is Astro Radiant, so it's not a new set. You're not guaranteed a holographic in every set. You're not guaranteed a Radiant. So that's definitely a blessing. You know that's getting bagged and tagged. Uh, the Susan Decidueye, the same. You know, one of my favorite cards and used in a lot of decks. I mean, it's not the best centered if you're looking at it, but quality wise, there's nothing on it. It's just, it's just an uneven cut, man. So that, that will, I'm not going to be sending that out to, you know, to get graded. But today, to open up a $10 tin, hoping for a sun and moon, 
and to get that i should have known something though when i when i seen them out there and i hadn't seen these in, in three years i should have known that maybe it was a remake we got the lost origin now always a good set there's a giratina in this in this set that's killing it right now so we got the code core guys let me know what you get mention in the comments I always like to hear that and with these older sets we definitely can go for from the back and let's hope for the best guys hopefully it's some fire we got the Thornton Komala Carbrink Inke Paris Zarua Azuzian version Finian Blitbug we got the spinner rack and the non holographic rare Landorus. It is a rare, it's getting bagged and tagged. But like I said, we're not guaranteed in these. So the fact that we got our two little hollows, Radiant Heatran and Decidueye, that's definitely a blessing. And thank you for guys for checking out my openings today. We got the Pokemon of the day, and y'all have a good one.